Hey guys, so my friend wants me to watch Game 5 of the Stanley Cup Finals with him. So I think I should get a jersey, the Oilers jersey. But uh, I don't see Austin Matthews. Oh my god. And Sidney Crosby, oh my goodness. And for Oilers, I could only find Wayne Gretzky's. Oh my god. Uh. All right, there you go. There's Connor McDavid's. But it's for kids. Oh, I'm small. So I guess this is good enough for me. Okay, I got the jersey part figured out. What about the food? Hmm. Oh yeah, that's right. Pizza. More pizzas. Yes, pizza's a great hockey game food. Let's order some. So last night, I ordered Boston pizza on Skip the Dishes. It has a 7.9 rating, which is not good, guys. That's terrible. 30 to 48 minute delivery time. Delivery fee was 479. Oh my God, that's expensive. It was about 5.5 kilometers away from where I am to restaurant. So not too far, but the delivery fee was expensive. Oh my God, and a bad rating too. Oh my goodness, what was I doing? And uh, I ordered the halftime square footer and it was one of their dishes on the playoff feature menu. And apparently it was the restaurant's new New York style Sicilian pizza and it's half pandera bread and pizza. And also it comes with a Santa Fe ranch dip. And for the pizza, I could choose two toppings. So I chose both prosciutto and pineapple. Well, prosciutto is not really a common topping, so I want to give it a try. And uh, I didn't want any more dips because I had to pay extra. And uh, I didn't have any allergies as well. Great. So at the end, I think the halftime square footer was around $31. And uh, this is the only thing I ordered. I didn't order any drinks. Well, $31 for pizza? It's expensive, guys. Uh, I'm on a budget. Okay, tip my driver. Since I was 5.5 kilometers away from the restaurant, so I wanted to tip half the distance and see how my pizza is gonna be like. And I ended up tipping the driver 275. Well, I guess not too shabby for just a pizza. So now the order sub total was 31.29. Delivery fee was $4.79, tip was $2.75, taxes were $5.10, service fee was $3.13, and now the final total was around $47. Oh my goodness, this pizza better be good. So then I went ahead and placed the order, and you know what? I had to wait for 21 minutes before a driver was assigned, guys. Oh my god, that took a while. What happened? Maybe it was because I tipped less than $3. Maybe. And his name was Simran. And uh, I think he has done over 2,600 deliveries. So he's not a new driver, guys. Not a new one. And he was pretty close to Boston Pizza too. Yay. And uh, I think it took him about three minutes to get to the restaurant. And you know what? He didn't wait for long. I think uh, he literally just stayed at the restaurant for like 10 seconds. And he got my food and he was heading my way, guys. Oh my goodness. So that means my pizza was ready, guys. Oh my God. He even tested me, telling me he's coming soon. Oh my God. He didn't want to wait because I tipped less than $3. Oh my God. So did my pizza arrive on time? And was it cold or hot? We'll find out right now. Hey guys, I got my food. So I'm guessing this is the Santa Fe ranch sauce. Yeah, uh, I don't know. Yeah, it is a ranch sauce. This is a ranch sauce. And this is the pizza. <laughs> Halftime pizza. Oh my goodness. So this is a $47 pizza, guys. Oh my goodness. And you know what? I think it's only lukewarm. Well, my food was already ready when the driver got there. So it's going to be lukewarm. And I don't think the driver used a hot bag either because I went to pick up the food and I saw him grabbing my pizza from the front passenger seat. So I don't think he put it in the hot bag. Well, I took just about $3, so yeah, it is what it is. It's still lukewarm though, so we'll taste and find out how it's like. And 51 minutes, so it's late. It's so late, guys. Oh my God. Well, I think so. It's summer after all, right? 
So there's gonna be cars everywhere. Oh my god. Oh my god. So this pizza could be cold, guys. I'll have to taste it and find out. But the driver was nice though. He was happy and everything. Well, I was waiting for him because he's testing me. <laughs> That's why he's happy. He didn't have to wait. Anyways, let's eat. Okay, so let's open this pizza. Okay, let me grab this. Okay, and then here. Okay, oh, oh. Oh, oh, look at this, guys. It looks like this. Oh my god. Yeah, this is their cheesy bread. I forgot what it's called. And this comes with a Santa Fe ranch dip. I hate ranch, but I'm gonna taste it for you guys. And this is the pizza part. Um, there's not much more prosciutto. Look, I'll grab a piece. Because they cut into like... So, the cheesy bread is in rectangles, but the pizza is in small squares. So, okay, here. I took a piece of the pizza out. Look, there's not much prosciutto, eh? Just a little bit. And you'll have a pineapple. I don't know. The $47 pizza. So I'm expecting more toppings. The one that the rating is only 7.9. And uh, Boston pizza didn't give me any napkins. So I'll grab my own. Oh my god. Okay. Let me try this. Oh. Mmm. Mmm. Oh. Yeah. It's not hot. Mmm. Oh, the prosciutto is very salty. Mmm. Oh. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm. I'm glad I ordered pineapple as another topping, guys. Oh, my goodness. Because the smoked prosciutto is so salty. Oh. Mmm. 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 Oh. Yeah. I would say, in terms of hotness, this is only 2 out of 10, guys. Oh, my goodness. And uh, I think if uh, Boston Pizza has the timing right, I think this pizza is gonna be warmer. Because by the time the driver got to the restaurant, the food's already ready, so. Yeah, it's a timing issue. Oh my god. Mm. Oh. Mmm. 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 And this pizza is so thick. Mmm. Oh. Mmm. It's so thick. Mmm. Mmm. Um. Mmm. Okay, let's try the cheese bread. This one. This bread. I'm too lazy to go to my phone and check what the name is. My hands are oily. I don't want to touch my phone. Mm. Oh. Oh yeah. It's a very thick cheese bread. Mm. It says it's a pizza, but it's not pizza. It's a cheese bread. Mm. Oh my god. The pizza have pizza, guys. Oh my god. Mm. Oh. Oh. Yeah, it's a two out of ten. It's not even hot. It's not even lukewarm. It's getting cold. <laughs> mm. Mm. But you know what? I prefer this cheese bread more because because the smoked prosciutto is too salty. Oh my god. Mm. Oh. Mm. 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 Oh, it's so thick. It's so thick. Mm. Oh. Mm. 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 A little bit crunchy too. Probably from the cheese, guys. <laughs> okay, let me open this bag and let's look at what the ranch looks like. Oh, a bag within a bag. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, oh, this is the ranch. Yep, it's called Santa Fe Ranch Sauce. Let me open it. I hate ranch, by the way. Oh, it has a sour taste and it's it smells hot. I'm gonna just dip a little bit and try. Oh my god, I hate ranch. I can't have ranch. Okay, so this is the piece of crust I'm talking about. This piece here. That's why it's crunchy, guys. So what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna dip a little bit. Ah, I can't handle ranch. Oh. Just like this, just a little bit, just a bit. I think I took too little. Okay, let me do a little bit more. Okay, there you go. This time there's more, see? You know what? It's not too bad. I think 
because it's called Santa Bay Ranch, it's not actual ranch. So it actually tastes a bit sweet. You know how ranch tastes like, right? It's like this sour, this disgusting smell, like blue cheese. I hate it. This is actually not too bad. I think this has like tomato and stuff like that. So um, it's actually sweeter than normal ranch. It's actually not bad. Mm. Yeah, not bad. It makes this bread less dry. <laughs> If I have options, I would choose this ranch, guys. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's dip a little bit more. Mm. Oh my god. Mm. Mm. So this is a forty-seven dollar pizza. Do you think it's worth it? Comment down below. I think uh, this is for people to share. It's not for only one or two people. It's for a whole bunch of people. Oh my god. And the pizza is so thick too. Just like Pizza Hut pizza, guys. Oh my god. So guys. I'm gonna finish my food here. So that's it for tonight guys. If you like this video, please click the subscribe button, smash the like button, leave comments, ask questions. I will always answer them. I've never missed anyone actually. So thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye guys!